Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how I have a slow morning on the weekends and how I fit in a little bit of self-care and with my cleaning to make both of them enjoyable and give me a little refresh for the week. I always start off by making my bed. I read a long time ago somewhere I don't know if it was a post on the internet, but if you make your bed, you finished one task and you're more likely to keep the momentum going. And I've done this for years. I make my bed every single day, even if it's in the middle of the afternoon. Then I just turn a Netflix movie on. This one is your place or mine. If you haven't watched it, I would highly recommend. I tried to turn either music or a movie or something on just to make it a little more enjoyable. If you're wondering why I'm folding my towels a little bit differently, um, my better ones I fold a certain way that are going in the closet and the other ones my boys use for either weightlifting or sports. They take them to school and I don't want them taking my good towels so I fold them so that they fit under their bathroom cabinet and they just grab a towel from there. I'm not sure what got all over this sweatshirt. I didn't see anything else in the laundry when I was folding it that had a stain on it, but there was two stains, one yellow and one pink all over this sweatshirt. I'm gonna have to try to stain remove it and see if I can get it out. As you can see in this video, I have some little eye patches on. Sunday morning, I try to do something skincare or something that just makes me feel good. And no matter what that is for you, just try to do one little thing that is gonna make you feel better.
after I'm done folding my clothes, I'm just going to go into my closet and get some hangers and hang up everything that I put off to the side that needed to be hung. Now after I'm done, I'm just going in my closet to hang everything up. Recently on my channel, I had a master bedroom clean with me or maybe it was called Mas clean out my closet or something. So if you guys are interested in seeing more of my closet, you can go check out that video. Also on the weekend, I like to pick out a couple things that really are driving me crazy throughout the week that I just really don't have time to do. And today it was dust these plants. All my leaves had dust all over them. I felt so bad for these plants. My plants have really taken a hard hit this winter. This day is sunny, but we've had a lot of dreary dark days and a lot of my plants this year are just not having it. After I finished with that, I put all of this laundry away and then I went in with some self-care. I, my nails, my toenails were so terrible, very terrible. That was another thing that was really driving me crazy. So sometimes I try to pick one self-care, maybe one deep cleaning item or decluttering that I need to do a week and just do that. It makes me feel so better just to do one task. I put stuff off and this only took me a few minutes um, and I felt so much better after it was done.
I normally paint my toes like white or something neutral, but I wanted to pick a bright, cheerful color just because it, it's almost spring. It feels like spring out in Iowa today. It is about 40 degrees and the sun is just making me feel like a whole brand new person. After I was done with my toes, I just filed my fingernails and put some cuticle oil on them. I didn't paint them at all. And I keep getting hangnails from dry dryness, I guess. I don't know. My, my skin is so dry right now. But so I just put some cuticle oil on to help soften them up. Leave a comment down below what you guys do for self-care. I'm just really interested. Do you guys do it on the weekend or do you do it during the week? Please leave it below and I would love to hear everybody's response. Thank you everybody so much for watching. I really appreciate the support. If you guys like this type of video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you haven't yet, I would love for you to subscribe. I'm really enjoying getting to know everybody and making friends. So if you haven't yet, please leave a comment and let me know your name and where you're from. I would love to get to know you. Thank you. Have a great week.